Hey everyone, can opener dude here. As you watch me fail on fiddlesticks, just wanted to give everyone a rundown on what I've learned about the new jungle enchantment, Runic Echoes. As you can see on the screen, it builds out of an Aether Wisp, an Amp Tome, and the jungle item of your choice. It costs 2450 to build from scratch and gives 60 AP and 10% movement speed. Now before we get into passives, I want to compare this to Runeglaive, which gave 40 AP, 250 mana, and 10% CDR for a cost of 2675. So on the surface, Runic Echoes is much more of a generic AP item, as opposed to Runeglaive, which was specialized for champions that meshed well with auto-attacking in between spells. The main point of interest with the new item, however, is that it applies the version of Luden's Echoes passive proc, meaning the jungle item still has an AoE, it's just that one that works in ganks too. Now without going into too many numbers, here's the takeaway points. Better all around AP item, while it still favors burst, it does so in a way that a lot more champions can benefit from. The passive now does not stack or combine with Ludens as of now, but this may change. It's cheaper than either Runeglaive or Ludens, meaning an AP jungler's power spike will come earlier. And finally, this item was just introduced onto the PBE yesterday, meaning that it's heavily work in progress, so don't get too infested in its current stats because they may be nerfed slash buffed before they hit live. Uh, that being said, I'm excited for the return of Jungle Fiddlesticks. Are you?